what's up my babies it's your girl Malaja serenity and i am back with another video and today we are doing a seafood ball a cook with me video i guess you could say i just got out the gym got on my cute little night outfit that y'all know i love to wear so yeah i'm about to cook and put everything now make sure y'all like comment and subscribe and if y'all try it let me know how y'all like it let me show y'all what i got so we got some lemon some corn, potatoes, cilantro, sausage, crab, shrimp. I got these bags because this time I'm gonna put them in the bags. I always cook my seafood differently every time, but this time we're gonna do it in the bags. I picked me up some extra seasoning right here that I needed. I showed y'all all the other seasons I'm using as well. Got some garlic, obey seasoning. For my sauce, I'm also gonna need butter. I got a lot of butter because we don't need that butter. I'm gonna show y'all all of the seasonings I got, let me put this. I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all all the seasonings I got because so y'all can know. And these are the seasonings that I'm gonna use when I make my sauce. So go ahead, write it down. Do what you gotta do if you need it. I'm gonna show y'all right now. So smoked paprika, seasoning salt, pepper. This is garlic salt. Get garlic powder if you have it. That's what I normally use. Onion powder, white vinegar, Cajun seasoning, Worcestershire sauce. I read pronounce that. Got some all purpose seasoning, some Texas Pete hot sauce. Only like Texas Pete. Lemon pepper. I already showed y'all this seasoning. The um chicken bouillon seasoning and some old bay seasoning. And you also gonna need some brown sugar. Like I said, I make my seafood different every time. Sometimes I use different seasonings, but these are the seasons that we got, so we're gonna make it out of what we got. Um I thought we had more seasonings before I went to the store, but I got back and we didn't. So we gonna use what we got and we gonna make something out of nothing, period. And then I also got some crab bowl that I'm gonna put inside of the um, seafood bowl as well. I already have my onions right here chopped up. I got them, this is gonna go inside of the bowl itself. So I just chopped them up any kind of way. And these are gonna go inside of my sauce. So girl, now that we got everything out of the way, let's get started. <laughs> Before we get started, I'm gonna go ahead and put like my water on, put my potato, corn, eggs, all that on. So that's what we're about to do right now. Now, like I said, it's different ways that you can cook seafood. I'm gonna just cook mine in water today, but if you wanna use beer or orange juice or something like that, you most definitely can. But today we're keeping it simple and we're doing it this way. And now I'm going to take these onions and just put in my water just to give it like a little flavor. A little bit of obey. I'm not gonna put too much because my mama don't like hot stuff, but the sauce I'm gonna make gonna be hot, but just a little bit. A bit of this right here. what it's looking like right now then i'm also put some garlic minced garlic in there and a little bit of the juice as well also take some lemon and put it in there as well so this is how the water is looking so far looking super good I got my corn and potatoes right here i just washed it off my first time doing a cooking video so i don't know like we're gonna get it together but we're gonna do what we can do with what we got so got them right here i'm actually about to cut up my sausage right now i like me personally i like to cook my sausage on the stove to kind of like brown them and get that like burn you know feel i don't really like to boil them in my bowl so that's just the extra stuff I like to take. If you want to throw them in your bowl with the potatoes and stuff, be my guest. Be my guest. I don't really eat these kind of sausages, so I'm going to just cook these for my family and put them in there. They don't have the sausages I like in Texas. The ones in the brown and white box. I forget what they call, but those are my favorite sausages. I don't really too much care for these kind of sausages, so that's what I'm going to do right now. Let me take a little cute picture. <laughs> Cook with me. Cook with me. <laughs> Let me post this on Instagram real quick, y'all. I've been trying to, to 
to stay so consistent like i like social media like i like vlogging and stuff but i'm really not a social media girl like posting and all that constantly is not me but i'm trying you know i'm trying So I got my camera lady behind the camera recording me, period. So we are about to take our um, corn and potatoes and put it in here, show the water. So it's boiling now. So we're just gonna kind of just drop everything up in there. <laughs> I'm gonna put my eggs in a different one just because sometimes they can cook slower or faster and i don't just want to overcook them or whatever if that's possible yeah i don't know but um we just put y'all this smells so freaking good so y'all see all that goodness up in there i'm gonna put the top on it and let it do its thing and then um like why this is like cooking or whatever I just be preparing like y'all see I'm over here cutting up the sausages and then um I'm about to clean off my seafood and I'm going to put that in here last because the seafood doesn't take long to cook of course this meal honestly don't take long at all then I'm gonna make my sauce it's really simple you know it's, it's really simple so yeah we'll be back in a minute when we get to whatever Y'all, we got some ice cream cake in here Hurry, for my mama's birthday slide. yesterday. So got the eggs on right now. And then I'm just gonna pour a little olive oil in here so I can go ahead and cook my onion. Well, start my sauce. Start my sauce. So I'm just gonna cook these down a little bit for a couple minutes so they can get like soft and have like a little browning on them as well want to let that cook I freaking love my y'all so I really should have put more in there but I ain't gonna cut up another one I ain't feel like putting up another one so we got it boiling everything clicking over here so yeah with the butter next so this is going to be like our sauce our the base to our sauce right here and it depends on how much you're cooking or how much butter you using how much sauce you need and we're gonna put a lot so we're gonna let this melt and then I normally like kind of eye to see if I want to add some more butter. And more than likely, I'm gonna have to add some more butter. More than likely. So everything kind of getting going. Got our eggs on. Then we got our um, potatoes and sausage. I mean, in um, potatoes and corn on. Um, and then really last, all we gotta do is um, cook our sausages and then come over here. Um, we have our clean crabs and it's a little dark over here, y'all. These are our crabs and shrimp that I already cleaned. So that's what we're doing right now. Got this melting y'all this is kind of like that's so ghetto but i had to do it because i need this front eye so that's what we're doing so this is what it's looking like right now and i think i'm gonna add up some more butter because we like sauce over here baby we, we like some good sauce so and i'm gonna save some butter too because my mom would just want some plain garlic butter too so a little bit more don't pay me. Don't pay me. <laughs> the fuck? Then we'll be back on because 
I'm gonna add my garlic and like all my spices and stuff in. I just didn't want to add my garlic first because I did not want my garlic to like burn. So I like to add my garlic in afterwards. So I'm gonna cut this lemon up really quick because um it go. I need some for my sauce and then I like to eat some on the side as well. But we just gonna cut this up for the sauce because I got another lemon. I think I picked up like three lemons. So that's what we're doing. Just want to go ahead and have it cut up. So, I love lemon, y'all. Lemon is. Oh, I love good. to eat them. I wish we had some lime. That's strong. But um, all right. Now I'm going to take my garlic and I'm going to like. I want to make sure I get all that juice up in there. So, I like to put a good amount of garlic in there and just mix it up a little bit. Y'all, I like to like be able to see my garlic. I'm gonna use the rest of this garlic right here. It's it's a bliss. Like <laughs> I don't know why. I just I love a vinegary sweet taste. Like I don't know. My like my taste buds are like kind of weird, but I'm telling you, add add some vinegar up and down, bro. You're not gonna regret it. So I'm gonna do a little. I'm gonna do a little measuring for y'all because I honestly don't got time for y'all to be asking, about no asking me about no measurements. If y'all watch my vlogs, when I click in my vlogs, y'all already know we don't measure. We just yeah, cook to taste. Yeah. Like, that's it. That's it, girl. Like, come on, bring that inner grandma out of you and just do it. But um, I'm gonna just pour a little bit in a cap. I'm gonna probably put like two capfuls for y'all. And then, so two capfuls mean three, honestly. So Ooh. it's gonna be a little vinegary taste, but if you don't like that vinegary taste, you don't have to add, you don't have to add, excuse my camera man, but camera woman, but yeah. <laughs> but you don't have to add that much. Um, anyway, let me get this brown sugar. Now, let me tell you, I don't really know about white sugar in here. I, I love to cook brown sugar. I cook with white sugar as well, but in certain things. But if you got white sugar, I mean, I guess you it. it's sugar. But that brown sugar, oh, oh, that brown sugar is gonna bring a different taste to it. So now, we finna go in and flavor this up. Look at all that garlic. Mm. Just look at it. So now we can just take it and add some flavor to it. It really don't matter what order you go in, but so I already done showed y'all all these sauces now. So don't come down below asking me what what sauces you use. Just girl, just just I already told y'all now. Then we're going. Oh, this Texas P is going. To me, it, it's not. It don't really be hot. It just adds some good flavor. Like I love Texas P. And now I'm just going with my seasonings and I literally just season it to like see, I mean to taste, whatever. So I add a good bit of seasonings. Oh shit, that's all the black pepper we got right there. Seasoning salt. Now don't like, don't be adding too <laughs> much now. Cause girl, I did not tell you to add that much. You know, just know how to eye it. I should have put it in a bowl for y'all so y'all can see, but. We, you can also taste it as you go and whatever you feel like you need to add more of, just add more of. Now I done showed y'all all these seasonings. All this, every single season that I show y'all, this that garlic salt, I'm not gonna add too much of that because but use garlic powder instead. This now this lemon pepper seasoning. I like to add a lot of lemon pepper seasoning. I ain't even gonna hold you. I I cook everything with lemon pepper. It's like literally nothing that I don't cook without lemon pepper seasoning. This Cajun seasoning, I ain't gonna put that much because child my mama gonna be talking about her mouth burning. So probably still gonna be too hot. Oh, yeah, probably like chicken seasoning. And seafood, yeah. It'd yes. be good. Y'all see how the color like, kind of starting to change? Excuse that stove, y'all. I didn't even wipe it off. Mm. 
Um, with this brown sugar, I'ma add, like, I don't know how y'all like it. I like mine kind of sweet. So, if y'all got some Coke, that'll be good in here too, like the soda. Ooh. So, before I taste it, I'ma kinda let it cook. Before I taste it, I'm gonna let it cook and like get all the flavors and stuff in there. Let it cook for a couple minutes. Oh, hold on, y'all. I forgot my lemon juice as well. Excuse me. So, this is a must. I might throw that one on in there. And then we're gonna let that do what it do. All right. Okay, so y'all, I just tasted the sauce. It's been cooking like three minutes, and I'm not gonna lie, nothing needs like is perfect. Nothing needs to be added to it or taken away. But like I said, I just burnt my phone. But um, like I was saying, when you taste it, fix it to your liking. If you wanna add a little one two, take away a little one two. Add something else to it. If it tastes good, let me know, girl, and I will try it. But I'm about to check on these potatoes and stuff right now. Girl, I just burnt the mess of my tongue. Well, it would have been smarter to you. Okay. So. so, they really tender, but I'm gonna cook a little bit more. Then I'm gonna go ahead. I'm trying to debate. Damn, that was a wild cup. I'm trying to debate how I wanna cook these. Um, I love lemons, y'all. Lemons are so good, and I just eat them too because they are good for your immune system and if y'all know y'all know your girl be going through it so all right hey y'all so my sausage and i mean my potatoes and all of that good stuff is really done so I'm, i was going to steam these but i don't know something going on i don't know how to work the little things so we're just going to throw them in the pot and then cook and it honestly don't take that long to cook just put them in for a couple of minutes Make sure everything all down in there. Really make sure everything is down up in there. On the shrimp. And y'all see how fast some shrimp turning? Like it literally only take oh shit, my bad. It only take a couple minutes to um excuse me. Mm -hmm. So gonna let it cook for about five to ten minutes, probably not even ten minutes. And then if, if your shells like to your crabs are hard, like still when you try to crack them, that's how you know you put them too long. So, all right, I'll be back home in a minute. I'm about to go in and cook my sausages right now. Um, I'm just gonna use some olive oil. Oh shit. And pour, excuse the pan y'all. I know it's clean, but baby, we don't use her down. So, I'm just gonna let that heat up really quick. So y'all, I like cut them open and I kind of left them a little big. But um, did I not cut them? But I'm but I should have just put them in like these trying to rush. But yeah, that's pretty much what we're doing. I'm gonna let these um, cook 
to cook. I'm gonna open them up because I should've did that from the get go. I had a pot. But like I said, y'all, if y'all um if y'all want to just throw them in there to boil with everything, y'all can do that. But I'm just a little extra, honestly. So this is what I do. Just so they can. And then that way, so when that sausage juice mix in, that'll be good. That'll be good. Mm. Look at that, y'all. So, I'll come back on. Really, honestly, everything done now, really all I gotta do is prepare it in a minute. So, I'll be back on. Looks super good. And everything is down up in there, so. Okay, so this is the bag, and I'm just gonna kind of like try to mix everything up in there. Another thing, I didn't season like my crabs and stuff because it's honestly a lot of like juice and stuff that's up in here, and I didn't want it to like be too salty. But if you want to like season your crabs, be my guest. This is what it looks like. Looks so freaking amazing okay so this my mama's on right here and i forgot to tell y'all i added cilantro as well i added it in there so this is what hers look like and she just got regular garlic butter so yeah I'm about to try it really quick for y'all. I'm gonna try to crack first because that's what I'm easy that was to crack. So good, y'all. I've been wanting seafood so bad. Damn, little lady. You so can't put it away. <laughs> I already told you, thank you. I hate when I see the veins in the truck. I'm not eating it. If I see a vein in the shrimp, I won't eat that shrimp. Which is crazy because veins are in other shrimps too. Well, baby, that's their Every shrimp got it. You hear me? What? I said, um, the, the vein part, that's where the boo-boo is at. I know, but why you had to say that? Huh? I know that, but why you had to say that? While I'm eating. You ready to eat? Hmm? Mm hmm? You ready to eat? Yeah, she fucking hard. that shit. Oh, eat, eat, eat. Huh? Sauce is immaculate, girl. Hold on, you got it. First of all, come here. Y'all got come here. Come here. On, First of all, when you do her seafood, when you do her her seafood, you need to get your sauces, your potatoes, your shrimp, your crab, mm -hmm. your corn, or your egg. Mm -hmm. And you dip that shit in there. Dip it in there. Look at this. Mm -hmm. You see that? Mm -hmm. He said that sauce that is good. Too good. Her. Let's get the bill. Her. So like I told y'all, y'all better take those hostages and cook them, you know, on the thing before before y'all, what you call it, and put it in there because it's gonna taste 10 times better. But next, cook some chitlins. Ew. <laughs> so that is the end of the video, you guys. 
I really, really hope that y'all enjoyed it. Let me know if y'all want to see more videos of me cooking, which I cook all the time in my vlogs, but I never really do like, I had to make some more sauce, y'all. I told y'all. But um, yeah, just let me know if y'all want to see more, whatever more y'all want to see from me. I love y'all. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure y'all shop for any posh, everything down below, along with y'all coupon code. The fuck? Okay. But yes, y'all, I love y'all so, so, so much. Thank y'all for y'all support. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe, share this video, cook it. Let me know how y'all like it. Tag me in y'all little pictures or whatever, and I will talk with y'all later.